Hello everyone, welcome to the next lesson of physic. Today I will explain you the new title of physic. That title is System of Units. Okay, in previous video we studied physical quantity. Physical quantity divided in two parts, fundamental quantities and draft quantities. Okay. You understood the okay, physical quantities. Now I will tell you, for measuring quantities, we have three system of units. Okay, number one, British system. Okay, we can say FPS system. And another one is metric system, or we can say SI system. Okay, now move on. British system, what is British system? This system is more common more common in English-speaking countries, okay? Some countries, it means utilize this system like Britannia, like London. In London, okay, this, you, uh, use this system, okay? And this system, the unit of length is foot, represented by F. The unit of force is pound, represented by P. The unit of time is second, or we can represent by S. Okay, do you know, I, tell, I told you before that British system is called FPS system. Okay, now you should remember that F is what? F represent foot, F is represent what? Foot, yeah, pound. P is pre uh, represent pound. And S represent second. Or first, you should remember, first is the unit of length, second is the unit of force, and third is the unit of that, the unit of second, the unit of time, or we can say the unit of time is second. Okay, these are all about British system. Okay, let's come to metric system, or we can say SI system. SI system adopted in, adopted in 1960, and this system is universal. It means all countries use this system. And you know that British system, it means some countries use British system. But SI system, all countries use, it means SI system. Okay, one, one, uh, okay. what is the another benefit of SI system? SI system is based on the power of 10. Okay, such as? 1 decimeter is equal to 10 to the power of minus 1 meter. 1 centimeter is equal to 10 to the power of minus 2 meter. 1 kilometer is equal to 10 to the power of 3 meter. It means the SI system is based on the, the, on the power of, of 10. It means relation between each small and large unit okay, based on on the power of 10, okay, 1 decimeter, 1 centimeter, 1 kilometer is equal to 10 to the power of 3 meter. Okay, another benefit of uh, SI system, and this system for each small and large unit is given a specific name and it is used as a prefix before the units. Okay, students, I tell you that we have two uh, system of unit, British system and SI system. Okay, SI system is, un it's, uh, it means it's universal system, it means all countries use this system. And also I tell you that for each a small and large unit is given a specific name and it is used as a prefix before the units. It means in this system, in SI system we do this. But, okay, now I will tell you what is prefix. Prefix are the preceding factor used to represent very small and very large physical quantities in SI units. Okay, it means prefix used before units. Okay, we study units. Okay, we have two kinds of units. Fundamental units and draft units. Okay. Large prefix, we have large pre prefix, prefixes and we have small prefixes. It means this prefix used before unit. Okay, large prefix, okay, here we have large prefix, okay. 
Okay, let's we uh, okay discuss about prefix, symbol, and value. Okay, here we have deca. The symbol of deca is d, and the value is ten to the power of n. And hecto, kilo, mega, giga, tera, pita, exa. They're all large prefix, and the symbol and the value of each of them I will read, I read, I written on the board. Okay, you can write down, and also you should memorize each of them. Okay, what is deca? What is the symbol of deca? What is the value of deca? And also, okay, you should memorize, for example, kilo. What is the symbol of kilo? K. Okay, what is the value of K? Okay, kilo is ten to the power of three. Okay, you should memorize each of them. Okay, now, okay, move on, small prefixes. A small prefixes, prefix here we have symbol and value. Okay, small prefix are this. DC, centi, milli, micro, nano, pico, femto, auto. And these are the symbols and these are the value of that. A small prefixes. This prefix is used before units. Okay. Uh, let's look at some examples. Let's look at some examples. I will write here some ex examples for you. Okay. Here we have, for example, okay, 10 kilometers, uh, 20 kilometer. Okay. Kilometer is the magnitude. Or we can say the magnitude of number. Okay, and also here we have kilo. Kilo is what? It's prefix. Which prefix? Large prefix. And what is meter? Meter is unit. Okay, this is, we, we said it that it is 20 kilometer. We use kilo before units. Also, okay, suppose here we have Okay, 20, okay, 100 micrometer. What is here? 100 is value, value of, value of number. Okay, what is micro? Micro is prefix. Which prefix? A small prefix. And meter, meter is where? Meter is unit. Also, we use prefix in second in kilogram or uh, okay, we can use in gram, okay, second for each unit we can use prefixes. Okay, suppose here we have a millisecond. Okay, millisecond, for example, here we have, okay, 10 millisecond. Okay, what is 10? Value or magnitude. What is milli? Mere is prefix. Which prefix? A small prefix. What is second? Second is unit. Fundamental unit. Okay, my students, uh, we uh, studied uh, system of units. We have two system of unit, British system and SI system. Now I will tell you kinds of metric system. Kinds of metric system, we have three kinds of metric system, CGS system, MK system, and MTS system. Okay, also we can say, okay, let's come to CGS system. Also we can say centimeter, uh, gram, second system. Okay, in this system, the unit of length is centimeter. It means here, a C represents centimeter. The unit of mass is gram. G represent gram, and the unit of time is second, C represent the second. Okay, this is CGS system. Okay, now move on uh, to MK system. MK system also we can say SI. Just MK system is called SI system. We cannot say CGS system SI system. Just we can say MK system SI system. In this system, the unit of length is meter. Okay, M represent meter. The unit of mass is kilogram. K represent kilogram. The unit of time is second. S represent second. Okay, now come to empty system. Okay, in this system, the unit of length is meter, 
Okay, here we have M. M represents matter. And the unit of mass is tune. T represents tune. Okay, the unit of time is second. It means second S E C S represents second. Okay, my students, if you want to understand physics very simple and easy way, okay, try to find follow our channel, YouTube channel. And if you have any questions, okay, write write down and tell me. I inshallah I will answer your all of questions. Thank you for your watching.